Hey viewers, thanks for tuning in to another video. This is coming to you from Augusta National. No, I'm just, I'm just joking. This is actually coming to you from Renditions Golf Course in Maryland. And uh, yes, you read the title right. This is Amen Corner because Renditions is actually a replica course. And so obviously these are three holes that everyone probably has circled on the card. It is Amen Corner. So I believe on this one, it's hole six, seven, and eight. And it's replicas of hole 11, 12, and 13. So you saw the cocky fist pump, but just take a look at the shot I just hit. You got water that way. I think everyone knows what bridge that looks like. Then you got water that way. I just tried to lay up around here. I got a lucky rolling on the green. Let's go, baby. Had to pause the cart for a second. This is pretty cool. What a cool touch. Take a look at that. Uh, they got the scoreboard. Really quick, I'm going to cut some pictures in from the real course just for comparison. Scoreboard. I think you guys see what holes are coming up soon. It's actually pretty cool. I'm very impressed so far. And to top it off, any any golf course that has electronic carts with GPS, I know it's probably a shitload of money, but these are just game changers. Absolute game changers. Um, let me go ahead and drive up. That's me about 20 feet from the, from the pin. Told you it was a good shot. And this is my first time playing Renditions Golf Course. I didn't know what to expect. And, you know, while I didn't expect the course shape, the grass, the cuts, you know, the speed to be exactly like the greens at the respective courses, one thing I think I took for granted was the actual hills and slopes and, and just the layout of the greens were actually the same as if it were the real course. And I learned that from my TPC Sawgrass uh, Hole 17 video. So check that out if you haven't seen it. All right, this hole is too beautiful. It's one of the ones I was looking forward to. I'm gonna play two balls. Obviously the first one's what I'm counting for my score, but I feel like just you have to take a couple swings. It's playing 156. I'm playing a full eight iron, which should be about 160, but I need about 145-ish to cover that bunker. Let's get it. And I don't know if my voiceover is actually covering it up, but if you can hear in the background, like the maintenance crew had the most obnoxious, like. I don't know if it was, it wasn't like a lawnmower and it wasn't like a handheld grass cutter thing, but it was just a noise machine basically. And it was so distracting. So I'm not gonna blame that on me hitting it into the sand. And um, you, know, you can see on my second ball, I don't actually show it, but it's pin high. So it's perfect, uh, about 25 feet to the left. We got the Ben Hogan Bridge. God, this is cool. Fairly impressed so far, very, very impressed. I was reading up on this hole just after the facts. So I was curious, and I think it was like Bubba Watson or someone was just talking about how uh, this green, it's basically like, it's a dime. It's so, so tiny, it's so narrow. Um, obviously there's bunkers short, bunkers long, there's water to the left and short. So yes, the cheesy saying of get it on the green and two putt um, is, is a very good score here. Uh, you can see in my initial line, I went right at the flag, so shame on me. Maybe I should have played it safe, but hey, I mean, we didn't come here to lay up, right? But yeah, not a bad bunker shot, not a bad two putt. Let's just move on, try and birdie this. Byron Nelson Bridge. I'll be honest, don't know who that guy is. I'll probably uh, Google him when I get home, but super cool, super cool. And just as an aside, I did try, I took a second ball off camera and see if I could carry the trees Bubba Watson style. You know, if everyone remembers, he easily cleared the trees and had like a sand wedge going into the year he won the Masters. Just absolutely amazing. All right, laid up to about, I haven't gunned it yet, but I'm thinking about 85, 90 yards. How many majors were decided on this hole? I'm actually really excited for this shot. Let's get it close. Dart. Oh yeah, that was fun. It's like a birdie. And yeah, that, that, that just felt really, really good. Um, the wind was in my face and my only swing thought was just get it over, get it on the creek and just give yourself a putt. It actually happened to be a really, really good swing, um, unfortunately. And by the way, I don't know, like this green was ridiculous 
ridiculously fast, and I'm assuming it's not even close to what real Augusta is, but uh, you know what? We'll take a two putt, take a par, and we finish two over through the three, and I am not mad. I told you my goal was to play this better than bogey golf, better than par would have been a dream, but hey, hope you enjoyed this and stay tuned for the full round at Renditions.